Every student faces problems in the JE preparation and even I also faced some problems on my back backlogs that I had uh, initially and after some four, uh, 6 to 8 months of 11th I improved upon the concepts and I was able to get good marks also. Hello everyone, I am Gurra Subhas Sajjan and I am studying at Akash Bengaluru for JE Mains and Advanced. I joined Akash uh, two years ago. Uh, this is because I saw its I saw the anti advertisements and even its results. So I wrote anti exam, achieved a good rank, and even got hundred percent scholarship. I decided uh, to study for engineering uh, because uh, I had lot of interest in mathematics and science in my class tenth. So I s shared this decision with my family because uh, and uh, my family was too happy because my sister was studying in medical and I am going to become an engineer. I started to prepare for JE from Akash. I want to pursue CS from best IIT in India after my JE. JE is an exam that requires good preparation strategy to start with. My preparation strategy for the JE mains and advanced examination was uh, to solve as many questions I could on a daily basis and ask the uh, questions that I didn't get the uh, that get, that I didn't get them on the previous day to my teachers and uh, get some shortcut tricks like get some tips of where I was doing mistakes in the questions and where I was spending a lot of time and uh, whenever I used to not understand any concept in the class I used to ask uh, all my doubts to the teachers and my teachers would clear them. Every student faces problems in the JE preparation and even I also faced some problems like uh, not under and I was not able to understand uh, uh, chemistry and physics initially in my 11th so whenever I had an opportunity I tried to ask my teachers and I, even I tried to learn a uh, lot of times so uh, as time passed I was able to cope up uh, with the concepts and uh, I was able to cover all my back backlogs that I had uh, initially and after some four, uh, 6 to 8 months of 11th I improved upon the concepts and I was able to get good marks also. Everybody faces these distractions. The best way to deal with the distractions is to not use the physical device at all uh, like laptop and the mobile phones. Just use them to give tests and if you have doubts uh, in the concepts or in the questions that you have just ask them to the teachers. Uh, they are expert uh, at it and they can solve all your concepts and even can give some of the tips uh, where you are wrong can even help you to improve at your solving methods also. The preparation for boards is not actually different from JE because the syllabus of JE and boards are literally the same like for maths, physics and chemistry. Just you have to read uh, like I had to read just English and computer science. So it was a very easy task for me whenever I had exams I used to cover up uh, the readings of them and I used to give exams and I even used to get good score. It was not like the, the preparation between the JE and boards had, had a big gap. JE is a, just a higher level of uh, board exams that we are going to give. And uh, the computer science and English part you can uh, do it in, uh, do it very easily as they are even interesting also. To say about this, uh, like I feel like the Akash study material is uh, more than enough for JE examination. If you solve every problem properly and analyze all the problems that you get in uh, step 2 and step 3, uh, that is more than enough for, for the JE examination. And even uh, if you want more material and your Akash provides uh, more materials like success magnet, skull crushers, if you solve them, that is more than enough. Even there are some revision programs like Spotlight that will help you to revise all the concepts and that helped me a lot to cope up with my 11th backlogs also. So I think Akash material is more than enough for JE preparation. My advice for JE aspirants is first uh, understand every concept. Don't just mug up, mug up them to save time. Uh, you should understand every concept that will help you to remember for a longer period of time. The second one is Every time you should attend, attend your classes regularly and be honest to your teachers. Try to solve as many questions as you can. And uh, before every test, you should have finished almost every material as much as you can. And the third uh, one is attend the tests properly and uh, do analyze them after the test because they will help you a lot uh, to improve for the next uh, test. And the fourth advice is just, just uh, simply after the test, uh, keep the problems that you are facing in the test uh, with yourself. Uh, don't hesitate and ask the ask about the problems to your teachers also. The fifth advice is uh, stay away from these distractions that are present uh, in the devices like uh, Instagram, Facebook, 
uh, whatsapp and uh, many more because uh, these will not at all help in your je preparation and uh, if you want to crack please be away from these distractions this is all about my je preparation thank you and all the best